And now we can finally go to the Starlight Strand. Uh, I should probably bring some fruits with me. Probably, but... There are none growing here. Okay. I guess I'll find something. Heartbeat. Uh, I'm not sure if I need this. Because I haven't decided on who I'm gonna pair the rock slime with. But I see a pink plort here. I just need a pink plort. And we'll open some door. Let's see what this is. Oh, I think that's some new area. Not sure if I've been there. A cave. Okay. A treasure pod. Root tangle. A root tangle, you see. Uh, okay, so this is this exit. Let's see what what's on the upper layer. Just a box. Just a box. Oh. Oh, there's something there. I don't think you can go there, but you, I think you can just drop down from there into this cave. Uh, is this the same exit? No, but it's in the same direction. Oh, this is the way I came from. And what's in here? This has gotta be new. So like open here. I really like this. Just look at this. I won't take a screenshot. Let's go a bit higher. No, the honey slime. Wait, no, 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 no. I need honey plorts. Uh, go away. Okay. I sucked up the honey slime. That's all I need. Dude, this is so beautiful. I love this area. Oh, I found the bee. I grew attached to this tree when I first discovered it. I used to sit here and tell it about myself. But these days, it's different. I see myself in it now. Two different paths struggling against the other, bound to this island and changed by it. But I like this tree, I hope to leave the island someday. I wanna find a way home, I really do. Wait, is that tree like split? Oh yeah. Oh, the I think. wait. So, there was a tree here. That grew. And now it's... it's uh, a small tree grows here. Or maybe he's, t he's talking about this tree. Yeah, probably this tree. He has the pink side and the blue side. Anyways... Let's... Um... Let's take a screenshot. It's so easy to... Like... Ah... Uh, I don't know, it's really hard to land in one spot in this game.
Like, you always bounce very high. I wish I could remove the HUD, the gun. So like... I don't know how to do this. Let's take this screenshot. Really cool. Really cool place, I like it. There's a hunting guard though. Just noticed him. Lots of slimes here. Wait, Tars do not insta die? Oh, this is cute! They made a tower. This is so cute. I remember they did it in the first game as well. I thought Tars insta died in the water. Also, the damage animation looks kind of weird. Ooh, what is this door? Rock plot. I need a rock plot. Well, I don't think I can find any rock slimes in this area. Actually, never mind. I can find some rock slimes in this area. Uh, let's keep this here. So what is this door? Let's go away. A water cave. Interesting. Treasure pod. Storage cell. Use the fabricator to upgrade the VEC tank's booster. Oh, I found the upgrade for the VEC tank. Let's go. And I suppose this is open from the other side. I think this is where the honey plot goes. Treasure pod. Dash boot module. I didn't think there would be an upgrade to dash boots. But okay. I think this is the hole for the for the that cave. Where I first went. Ooh, another door for the rock plot. I can get it, I think. Let's see what this door is. Some cave. Interesting. Dude, I love these wobbly plants. Like, that's such a minor detail, but I love it. Oh, there's another. Wait. Oh, it's a bat plot. It's not a rock. Uh, are there bats here? They should be here, but I don't see any. Is this a cave? Huh. I guess they like more dark caves. Whoa, this is a huge tunnel. And I'm guessing this is for something new as well. Also floating mushroom. Okay. Uh, I need to get a bad plot. I want to know what's behind that door. But for this, I need to go into another area. I don't think I saw any bats here. 
Okay, so I went I went a bit too far. Also, let's find the map for this area. I need this area mapped. Oh, hey, Lucky Slime, I don't have a chicken for you. This is it. Okay. What is this? What is this island? Moon Dune Nectar. Okay. What's in here? Oh god. Where, where am I going? Uh, there's a treasure pod here. Spring pad launches anything that touches it into the air. I hope I'm not stuck in here. <laughs> I really hope for this. Okay, I'm not stuck in here. That's good. So I'm guessing the ringtail uh, Gordo gives you a teleporter to this location. Because I haven't seen anything behind him. And he's sitting on some platform. Okay, what, what is the island that shows on the map? Is this it? No. It's this thing. But I think I already wa- No, wait. Uh... Which one is it? Also, is this a new area again? I don't think I've ever been here. Max Cuberis. Uh, no, this is not it. What's showing on the map? That small island? I mean, that's not even an island, that's just a... Uh, part of the ruins. Ooh, what's here? I bet there is a secret! Oh yeah. I can't go here? Huh. This is weird. Maybe that's for something new. Or maybe I need to somehow unlock that area. Which will be interesting. So yeah, this thing, it shows it on the map. Uh, I don't want to lost my, uh, lose my Q-berries. So let's check it out later. And for now... I need to get to the Honey Gordo. He's so far away. There he is. Big Honey Boy. I brought you some Q-berries. There we go. Lop. A box and some slimes. What's here? There's some giant cave. Uh, phosphor. Okay. I know where to get those. Uh, no statue here. Oh, another phosphor. Okay. And a treasure pod. Topping coral columns. Okay. I'm not really interested in decorations. Oh, 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 oh! Dude, I need you. Stop eating his Q-berries, please! Dude, please, please eat. Thank you. And the one.
Oh, that's the door. Yeah, so it's as I thought. The doors are unlocked by the honey gordo. And this is the other door. Yeah. Okay. A little shortcut, I guess. <clears throat> so, all that's left is a crystal gordo, a bad gordo, a ring tail gordo, and a flutter gordo. Four gordos that I know of. Let's try feeding ring tail next. Yeah. I want to see where the teleporter goes. Oh. Oh, you're a Largo. Interesting. Okay. I'm not gonna take him with me. I'm just gonna go back. It's still growing. It has been 15 days. And it's still growing. Do you not need to replant it? Was that a thing in the old game? I mean the first game. Or am I too old? <laughs> and it was added at some point. Okay, let's see. Uh... Tank booster? I needed... Oh, power core. There we go. Dash boots, I need boom plorts. Let's also buy these. Dash boots too. New box, boom plorts, flower plorts, wild honey and lava dust. Wait, that's something... Is that new? Tank guard. Salvages 20% of your VAC tank's contents upon accidental encounters with the slime sea or following other forms of health loss. Whoa. Interesting. So now you can... Get this and not lose all of your stuff when you die. Interesting. But it also cost 3,000 bucks. Okay. I need to get my hands on the new plorts. Yeah, let's see about the pairing. Uh, so I have pink, cotton, phosphor, uh, rock, Rock I don't have. Tabby. Boom. And Bat. So I need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Why you gotta do this to me? Why you gotta make an uneven amount of slimes? Ah. <laughs> uh... Okay, I guess I will keep the pinks separated. Yeah, I think that's the best decision. So, I gotta transform my cats into something else. So cats eat stone hands. I got them growing. Uh, what I don't have. I can pair them with crystals. I can pair them with crystals, no problem. How many meat-eating slimes are there? 
Tabby, Angler, Boom, uh, Hunter, Ringtail? I'm not sure. Does Ringtail eat meat? Oh, he eats everything. Ah, so he's just like the pink slimes. Huh. So I gotta mix pink and ringtails then. And someone's gotta be on its own. Okay, so I pair pink and ringtails. I, I had a ringtail. Did it escape? No, he's still there. Hello. Okay. Then I'm getting rid of the cats. Eee. Are they not rendering when I like... Run away like this? That slime should be flying right now. But when I come back... He's still there. Like... I go here, I go see him, yeah, he unrenders, literally appears right in front of me. I mean, I guess that's for optimization, but it can lead to weird stuff like this. Let's go and grab... Uh, do I have chickens? Yes, I do. Holy shit, that's a lot of chickens. Just as usual. That's insane. That's interesting that they added another slime that can eat everything. That's a smug looking slime. <laughs> I have never seen him like that. Oh, he eats nectar! Yeah, right. It doesn't eat fruits. Also, what is this? Whoa, oh, no, 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 I don't, I don't want to go there yet. Nope, 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 no, 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 J not now. I don't know what's, what's there, maybe I can't go there yet, but still. I went somewhere and I decided that's... That's a thing to do for later. Let's feed a like slime, why not? Managed to feed it three times, what is this? Oh, this is nectar. Very sweet but very sticky, handle with care. <laughs> I thought I couldn't drop it. Uh, okay, I found the nectar, but uh, let's see how do you find it. This sweet syrup comes from Rainbow's, Rainbow Island's most unusual plant, the Moondew Flower, which only blooms at night. Ah, I see. Initially, scientists thought the buzz of this flower never opened, but that was just because they tended to call it quits around 5, maybe 4.45, if they were, if they were trying to beat traffic. That is, until that fateful night, when one Dr. Arnold Penobscot forgot about daylight savings time and wound up working an hour late. As I went to grab his jacket, he was surprised to see the moondew flower in full bloom. That's just how the discoveries are made sometimes. That's true. Moodyu garden can be planted in a garden, only fed to slimes. I see, so I need to pair flood of slimes with someone that I can farm with. I can farm the favorite food for. Lots of tars here, I wanna go out. Go out? Uh, go away. <laughs> Get out. Get out is what I want to see. Okay, Ringtail. Oh, <laughs> he 
needed the last chicken. And there's my teleporter. Let's collect ring tails. Oh, the honey ring tail looks pretty cute. Yeah, but I'll still need to figure out who to pair it with. I mean, not who to pair it with. Uh, I know already. I paired it with pinks. But I still need to find the cutest combination for the screenshot. Oh, this is so cute. Uh, have I checked out this bee? I used to start my mornings with a jog along this path. It felt so great to feel the sea breeze as I'd make my way to the hollow trees ahead. Sometimes I would even come back at the end of my day and watch the sunset. But I also think this is where I got robbed by a ringtail slime. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, it's already rotten. I only got 6. And I need 25. Wow. What an incredibly productive night. What is this? Oh, pomegranate. I need it. I need pomegranate. <gasps> Golden slime! That's a Oh my god, I found so... Okay, I found the golden slime. And uh, there's a pomegranate. Yeah. Okay, and I need crystal slimes as well. So, goodbye ring tails. Dude, I need... I know what I'm gonna do. I need to get as many ringtails as possible in one coral and have them all transform into stone. <laughs> I think that would look funny. So where's the giant halo or something around the volcano that I saw? Is that just... Oh, hello. Oh, come back! <gasps> he went so far. He flew so far away. What? That? That's just a scam. <laughs> that's just a scam. I could have got two lords from one slime. Oh. I need two more crystals. There you are. Let's feed him some pomegranate. Oh, so he guards the door. Ah, oh, so that's how you open it. Okay. Now, all that's left to discover is what is the crystal gordo for? Okay, let's remove uh, the crop. And plant pomegranate. Was there an animation before? I also don't remember that. Maybe there was, maybe there wasn't. Why are there so many chickens? How the fuck do you reproduce? Okay, well, uh, I have no idea, but at least there's this chicken. Let, let's put her in silo. That way I will never lose this chicken.
And also I will store gold plorts. Because that's cool. Sea heads in close proximity to roosters will periodically lay eggs that produce sea chickadees. Oh. Wait, but isn't it the same for every single chicken? Yeah. <laughs> Equal parts salt and fluff. So I guess this count says nearby. This count says close proximity. That they can breed with roosters beyond the two barriers. Okay. There's a tabby. Eat it. Eat the hen. He stole! He, he stole the water lettuce. Where are you going with it? <laughs> they all turned into stone. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Crystals. Tabis. <laughs> they look kind of weird, but whatever. Uh, let's buy an air net, just in case. Maybe I should finally buy an auto collector for all of this stuff. Yeah, because this is pretty annoying. Let's do that. Oh, it just costs 500. I can buy it for every single coral. There we go. Now it will be a lot easier. I think that's gonna be it for today. We did a lot of stuff. Oh. Okay, one final message. Uh, four final messages, actually. <laughs> Victor Humphreys. Beatrix, I have something I must share with you about the AI. As you know, we have been exchanging questions with one another. Well, this back and forth became faster and more casual over time, almost like a natural conversation. I assumed it was simply evolving and adapting to the style of talk it Ad adapting to the style of talk it observed in me, but then something happened. Well, we had begun playing games of Go as we, talk, <laughs> as we talked, uh, a way I could further test its intellect and no doubt how it could test mine. These games would go long into the night, and so would our conversation, feeling more and more natural even though I knew that, that the entity I was speaking to was just a complex collection of code. And then one day, as the sun was rising, it suggested just one more game. I said it certainly, but I needed to make myself a cup of coffee if I were to stay awake for it. And it replied, me too. <laughs> I just stared at the screen not knowing what to say, but as suddenly, as if it knew what it had just done, it disconnected. I have not heard from them since, but I hope I do. Until then, I will wait, staying busy with my work as always, asking those questions that need answers. But I will do so with a Go board ready for another game. Someday anyway. Goodbye, Beatrix. I hope to talk again soon. He still doesn't know that it's not an AI. That's a lost dude that has happened to him something on this rainbow island. You know, he just uh, play games of Go. Because, yeah, why not? Mochi. B, I've been trying to get a hold of you. I've analyzed one of the drones you have been finding all over that island and know why it seems so familiar with me. Uh, fa so familiar to me. It's mine. Or at least it's one that I've seen before. In my dreams, anyway. <laughs> After I looked at scans I took of it, I knew it was familiar, so I began looking through some old slime science journals of mine. These journals are mostly future projects, but sometimes they are speculative technology. 
You know me, I'm always thinking six steps ahead to keep Machi Tech on top of the industry. Well, sometimes I come up with the impossible stuff that I may never engineer in my lifetime. Oh, uh, well, sometimes I come up with the impossible stuff that I may never engineer in my lifetime. Well, those drones you're finding are exactly that. Impossible with today's technology and taken right from the pages of my journals. There's something I saw in a dream bay. So, how did a bunch of impossible drones I designed in a dream find a way from the pages of my journals to Rainbow Island? Maybe... Maybe there's some kind of archive in them we can unlock to learn more. I know they contain data logs, but if it were me... Well, I always know how to find a way of holding back what I need to. Okay, Bea, I need some time to think on this. I'll let you know if I come up with anything. Maybe I'll sleep a lot. <laughs> Ogden. Yeah. Oh, low sin to Beatrix. I'm not Spanish. I have been putting in a few long nights reading lately. Specifically, I've been going through every field guide and botanical research paper I could dig up on far far range. I thought that even if the flora on Rainbow Island is unnatural, maybe it would have re been recorded somewhere with some information we could use. And it turns out, there's nothing. I can't find a single mention of a rainbow hued flora anywhere. So that means that whatever happened to that island to make it look the way it does happened relatively recently. But I don't think you needed me to tell you this, because I think you've seen it yourself. The things you've described, an entire portion of the island split between the two different colors right down the middle? That sounds accident to me, Beatrix. So tread carefully out there. Nature can be... Can be be. Can be a dangerous thing to us, but it pales in comparison to what we can do to it. I'm gonna... I'm going to keep digging around in my library for anything else that could help you. And if I come up short there, maybe I'll just bake you some muffins. Either way, Titango Beatrix. Adios. Thora. Hey, Abea. How's life out there on Rainbow Island? Gosh, it's even fun to say. Must be a hoot. Yeah, sure. You know, ever since I heard you were off doing something new, I got to thinking about my own life and what's the next new for me. Upson and I have both seen and done so much in our lives, been one adventure after another across this dusty rock. And ever since we've become acquainted, we haven't slowed down one bit. So we're looking to take a new adventure together. We just haven't figured out what or where. Maybe we go exploring some hidden nook of the far far range like you, or even set our sights to the stars like Upson had done before. Whatever we decide to do, it'll be all the more special because we'll be sharing it this time with each other. It's that part that makes it all more exciting. It's so hard to find someone in this world that fits you completely, such a rare thing. Like finding two identical snowflakes in the desert. <laughs> True. I know you feel that more than I can say. I ain't ever losing sight of just how lucky I am there. I want to use the gifts the universe has seen fit to give me. What? I want to use the gifts the universe has seen fit to give me. Okay. I want to use the gifts the universe has seen fit to give me. <laughs> I don't understand the sentence. Ah. Really hard English in this game. <laughs> Okay. You keep your head up, girl. We'll chat again soon. Okay, cool. Lots of people all the doing their thing. Anything here? No. So they removed the mailing system. I see. Well, okay. That's it for today.